Hi guys, it's Rob Lester from Lester Bathrooms. Thank you for taking the time to check out our channel where we're all about bathrooms. And we're just closing out today on our latest project and I just thought I'd take you through it and just check out the features. So let me just spin it around for you and show you a bit of a walk around. Okay, and that's where we are. So not 100% finished yet, because the cabinet hasn't arrived. It's just running a little bit late because, you know, it's just running late. So we'll pop back and put it on. So the features in here are, it's a very sort of elemental bathroom. You know, it's got lots of natural elements to it with the, the sort of concrete effect tiles. And then you've got the sort of dark wood here and the black of the taps, the towel rail, and the, the valve and the shower head and stuff like that. So. We completely gutted out the whole thing in here, had a very, very big box section all the way across here, and we've gutted that all out, rerouted everything and put a nice tidy uh, basin and uh, toilet unit there together. Not a massive amount of room here, but I think it worked very well, and there's still plenty of space in here between the bath panel and uh, the towel rail over here. And um, so I ended up with this little area here, which we sort of tiled across the top and then infilled here to match the other side over here. So that works quite well. So we've got a really nice sit on top basin there, nice tall pillar tap. We've just got some water in there because it's all set. So it just keeps a bit of pressure in there while it's setting. And then obviously the rad is a nice neat jet black rads with matching valves down there. It looks very neat. I've just put the, incidentally, I've just put the chrome pipe work on for the moment, but I might see if I can get some black rad snaps and collars that I can replace those with, but that looks good. Then over to the bath. So we've got a nice deep bath here with white bath panel. And then we've got the jet black taps here, which are, Really nice feature, and then that comes up to the, the nice shower valve, concealed shower valve in here, a nice jet black. And this is on a pump, and then we've got the shower head up there. Nice jet black shower head. We put, we've replastered all this ceiling, and we've got all new lighting in here, all new IP rated LED down lighting, all fully tiled. I've actually uh, used this bathroom to do a little how-to video of how to tie into the window, so I'll put a link to that. And we've got a nice sort of satin chrome edging trim that you can see up there. Really, really like the units in that dark wood. I think it looks really nice with the matching black handles and black push button. And obviously the floor, let's just open the door a sec. We've done in the same tiles, but we chose to do a brick bond on the floor. We didn't do that on the walls because we wanted to get the feel of a bit more space. I think brick bond can be a little bit imposing on walls um, with the pattern. So we've just opened that up with a straight bond on the walls and then the brick bond on the floor. Right, that's it. I don't think there's any more features in here to show you. Oh, if you're thinking, how are we going to shower in here without making a mess? We're going to put a, the customer wants a curtain pole in this particular bathroom. So we'll put a curtain pole across here when all the sealant's dry, because at the moment all the sealant around here is soaking wet and we don't want the curtain to brush into that. So there we go, just a quick spin round and just showing you what we've been up to. Great, I hope you enjoyed it. Check out the channel for more feature bathrooms like this and we've got some how-to videos and loads of stuff on there so great we'll see you on the next one cheers bye